Welcome back. And now for the news in detail. British Prime Minister Boris Johnson has suffered a double defeat in the Commons after MPs rejected his attempt to force an early election. Earlier, Johnson lost a key vote to opposition lawmakers who want to block a no-deal Brexit. This report has more. With the fate of the UK's exit from the EU hanging in the balance, Prime Minister Boris Johnson is in the midst of a major parliamentary showdown. His bid to take Britain out of the EU by October 31st, with or without a deal, has divided the country. The government's rebel MPs and the opposition have joined forces to block a Brexit without a divorce deal. They voted in favour of the bill to delay Brexit until January 2020. The eyes to the right, 298. The nose to the left, 56. Retaliating, Johnson immediately pushed for a motion to hold a snap general election on October 15th. But he failed to win the necessary two-thirds majority, only mustering 298 of the 434 votes required. The eyes to the right, 298. The nose to the left, 56. So the eyes have it, but the House will be aware that the motion has not obtained the majority required under the Fixed Term Parliaments Act 2011. Unlock. After the ballot went badly, Johnson chided opposition Labour leader Jeremy Corbyn before MPs. I can only speculate as to the reasons behind his hesitation. Mr. Speaker, I can, I, the, the, the obvious conclusion is I'm afraid that he does not think he will win. Yeah. And... The government said the bill to stop a no-deal Brexit will complete its passage through the Lords on Friday. It also announced that EU nationals who arrive in the UK before the end of 2020 can stay until December 2023.